uh, let's slide to this this little bigger man, Bow Wow. He, him, I, and I've been seeing like on like JD and Currency, they got an album coming out, and uh, we talking about Jermaine Dupri. You know what I'm saying? Just so they can know. This nigga, Bow Wow, been like tripping on this nigga, like on the low key side. Mm. So it's one clip I seen. Uh, Bow Wow say, like, how you did more than Snoop, or, or no, this is the first thing he said. Snoop put him in the game, like, basically, like Jermaine Dupri ain't did shit, nigga. I started off with Snoop, nigga. Death Row, nigga. You feel him? Yeah, he Which did. Is true, but Jermaine Dupri glowed you up, bro. Snoop wasn't writing them raps, nigga, and he wasn't writing them raps. You, I mean, you know, Bow Wow, Snoop wasn't writing them raps. Well, Snoop named him. Huh? Snoop named him Bow Wow. Yeah, Snoop named him, for sure. But he for gave sure. him the baby because he couldn't, he was too young to do something with with that gangster image. So he gave him to somebody a little bit more clean. So Snoop still looked out for him by having JD uh, do what he did. So both of them niggas get credit, man. Bow Wow can't uh, say JD ain't do shit. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, he ain't trying to give JD no credit. I'm gonna hop into this video as soon as this motherfucker is. You know who he sounded like? Who? Romeo. Yeah, yeah. Spoiled ass little kids and shit. You got these industry daddy ass niggas and y'all niggas, man, your whole career you've been spoiled for. Yeah, so JD been going on interviews saying he basically came up with 106 Apart. Man. Bow Wow was the first artist on 106 Apart. Yeah. He the one that named Mr. Lil Bow Wow Mr. 106 Apart. So he basically came up with a platform to get his artists popping. Yeah, but they don't want to give him the credit. And Bow Wow don't want to give him the credit neither. It sounds like, you feel me? I mean, if you said something, though, like, if you just said the idea and, and walked out, <laughs> you know what I mean? If it ain't no paper, then motherfuckers, you need the receipts. 
But some tell me JD Wood had a receipt to that. Yeah. He got the receipts, but I, I think he might have been like, I don't want to say that I made it. A, you know what I'm saying? And did all that. But he said, I pitched the idea to that nigga. And next thing, and next thing you know, he had a show. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So basically, I did. I had that spark. What Pac say? Yeah. He sparked the, the seed of the whatever he said. That's what JD did to that nigga. He sparked the yeah. brain. You feel me? Yep, yeah, yeah, he did. That's a fact. So oh, no, man. everybody should get their credit, man. Snoop should get his. JD should get his. Everybody along your path to help you out. You can give them theirs. You know what I mean? But do you think Bow Wow wrong for? Yeah, like you said, he on some little wrong with your shit. You feel me? Yeah, niggas got see it's I can't even believe niggas no more. The motherfucking uh the internet so capitalicious, you know what I'm saying? It's like them niggas I, I think the nigga got a, a project coming out or something. A movie or a book or something coming out, man. The niggas will start doing some ridiculous shit and then they have something coming out, bro. Yeah, because you, know, you, know, you see they both on the press run, they doing interviews and shit. Yeah, that's it. That's it, man. Cause I never heard shit about you know Lil Bow Wow JD getting into it until shit fucking JD said something. They might have had some riffraff on the, on Instagram, but that's where I first seen it at on Instagram. But then I see JD doing interviews now, and then I see Bow Wow doing interviews. Yeah, something coming up. Something coming up. Yeah, but do you think if it's not no clout chasing shit, do you think they could like get their relationship back together? That's that yeah, like it's pops, man. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. I think that man, it'll happen, man. When when everybody got some paper, man, everybody happy, man. If you know all that shit lined up for everybody, it'd be cool. You know what I mean? Them niggas successful and shit. Bow Wow might not be where he want to be, but that nigga had a whole career, man. That nigga worked at BET. He just said it. Yeah, yeah, for sure. You know what I'm saying? It's like, come on, bro. 